What's up guys, today I'll be showing you how to theme your device on iOS 7 without the need of a jailbreak. Let's go! Since the iOS 7 jailbreak is a ways off, I thought that I would show you a cool way to more or less theme your device without the need of a jailbreak on iOS 7. You do need to download an application called App Icons, which is 99 cents on the App Store 44 version. But there's also a free version available, which is probably missing a lot of the coolest things about the app. So I recommend you go ahead and buy the full version of the application. Jumping inside of the app, you are brought to a list of available themes. Flat, blue, round, or even Christmas theme. There's something here for everyone. You can search through the top 200 new icon packs or the top 200 new popular icon packs. It doesn't really matter as long as you find something you like. My personal favorite pack is the flat theme pack, which is the pack that I'll be demonstrating how to install today. 10 internet cookies to anyone who can tell me how many times did I say the word pack in this video. To install your very own pack, go ahead and choose your theme that you will be using and begin to check out the app that you already have installed on your device. If you don't have an application installed on your device and you happen to click it, you will be redirected to the app store if you choose to go there. One downside to this is that it requires you to be connected to the internet at all times because you are essentially using bookmarks to redirect the app in question. Another downside is that it doesn't theme every app on your device. In most cases, it doesn't even theme the stock application but there is an option for you to design your own app icon and redirect it to your app of choice. Jumping back into the installation process, after you have selected your apps, go ahead and click the install button and from there confirm by clicking save and install. After you've been redirected to the settings app, you're going to go ahead and click install and install the icon pack. Next, they're going to ask you to go ahead and confirm the action in which you'll go ahead and click install now and enter your password. You have to do this every time you want to change your icon packs. You can simply delete the pack after you're done with it and revert back to your standard app icons or switch it up a little bit and go with a new icon pack. As you can see, I now have my app icon pack of choice on my springboard, and if I click any of them, I'm not redirected to the app in question. It doesn't theme the app internally or anything, and everything works the same as just before. But we seem to have a problem here. My original app and the icon pack are both on my springboard at the same time. Since this only serves to clutter my springboard up, I went ahead and dropped the original application inside of a folder and tucked it away. Please refrain from deleting the apps as it will make the app icon pack useless. That's pretty much it guys. Be sure to hit that like button if you enjoyed and subscribe for more videos just like this one. Follow me on Twitter and Instagram at JailbreakOrmy and like my Facebook fan page at facebook.com slash JailbreakOrmy. Don't forget to check out the description box of this video for a download link to my wallpaper collection and I'll see you in the next one.